can't leave you've got double English. English is well dry. I don't see what's so great about reading anyways. No, nah, reading's for losers. <laughs> In it, though. At least we've got a new teacher today. Yeah, right, that'll be a laugh, won't it? Morning. All right. As I'm sure you're aware, my name is Mr. Logan. I'm your new English teacher. Nice to meet you all. Hope you're all ready to <laughs> get to grips with some Elizabethan literature. Let's all turn to page 53 in our poetry textbooks. I think we'll dive straight in with the bard himself. Sir? Yeah? Are you English, sir? No, I'm Scottish. So you ain't English, then? <laughs> no, I'm British. So you ain't English, then? No, I'm not, but as you can see, I do speak English. But I can't understand what you're saying, sir. <laughs> Well, clearly you can. Sorry, are you talking Scottish now? <laughs> no, I'm talking English. Right. Don't sound like it. OK, whatever you want. No! Let's get on with Shakespeare. I don't think you're qualified to teach us English. I am perfectly qualified to teach English. I don't think you are, though. You don't have to be English to teach it. Right. Have we got double English or double Scottish? <laughs> Is your name Lauren Cooper, by any chance? Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> Why? Your reputation precedes you. Any it, though? <laughs> so, Shakespeare's sonnets. Sir? A sonnet is a poem. Sir? Written in 14 Sir? lines, the last two Sir? of which must form a Sir? rhyming couplet. Sir? Yes, Lauren? Can I ask you a question? Not just now. Can I ask you a question, though? Just wait. But can I just ask you a question? I only want to ask you a question. Can I ask you a question? I'm just asking you a question. Can I ask you a question? <laughs> what is it? Are you the doctor? <laughs> doctor who? I don't know what you're talking about. You look like Doctor Who, though. I'm not Doctor Who, I'm your English teacher. I don't think you are, though. Lauren. I think you're a 945-year-old Time Lord. Listen. <laughs> Did you just pitch up from Mars? Don't be ridiculous. You know your house, right? What? You know your house? Yeah. Is it bigger on the inside? You'll be quiet. If you park the TARDIS on a meter. <laughs> Can we please get back to Shakespeare? Thank you. So... Do you fancy Billy Piper, sir? Right. <laughs> you are the most insolent child I've ever had the misfortune to teach. Thank you. <laughs> You're pointless, repetitious and extremely dull. A bit like Shakespeare. <laughs> You're not even worthy to mention his name. William, Shake William Shakespeare was a genius. You, little madam, are definitely not. Now, just sit there, keep your mouth shut, or I will feel you in this whole module right now. <laughs> I missed... I bothered. <laughs> I missed a bother it for, Sue. Lauren. Look if at my face. I don't... Look if at my face. Stop it. Is this the bother it face that sees before then? Right, I'm calling your parents. Are you disrespecting the house of Cooper? <laughs> Aren't thou calling my mother a pox-ridden wench? No. Aren't thou calling my father a goodly rotten apple? Lauren. But he ain't even a goodly rotten apple. Listen to me. But he ain't even a goodly rotten apple, That's though. enough. Face it. Lauren. Bother it. Lauren. Look it. Enough. Look it. Enough. My leash, my leash, my leash, my leash. Fred, face it, You take the high road and I'll take the low road. I ain't even bothered. I ain't bothered. Look, face, bothered. Bothered, face, bothered. I ain't even bothered. My leash, I be not bothered. For soup, I be not bothered. Face, bothered, I ain't even bothered. Face, bothered.
of Shakespeare, sonnets, I ain't even bothered. My mystery eyes are nothing like the sun. Coral is far more red than her lips red. If snow be white, why then her breasts are done. If hair be wires, black wires grow on her head. I have seen roses damask red and white, but no such roses see I in her cheeks. And in some perfume is there more delight than in the breath that from my mistress reeks. I love to hear her speak, yet well I know that music have a far more pleasing sound. I grant I never saw a goddess go. My mistress, when she walks, treads on the ground. And yet by heaven, I think my love as rare as any she belies with false compare. Bite me, alien boy! <laughs> <laughs> a rose by any other name would smell as sweet. <laughs> I still ain't bothered. <laughs> Marlowe. Shakespeare. You all right? Just adjusting. You all right? Yeah, just trying to keep busy, you know. Mm. You writing? Oh, I feel... Inspired. You? Writing? Yeah. Uh, in a way. In what way? Personalising a poem. Ah, yes, well. Quicker than writing a new one. Well, it's for charity. Oh! Oh, for the auction? Yeah, it's a good cause. Ah, yeah, I autographed a page of my thrillingly controversial play, Tambling. How much did it go for? Seven shillings. Nice. I think they would have liked me to have made an appearance too, but, um... No, with all no, sure, yeah. I'm going to write about this. About the plague? Yeah. Is that what people want? Yes, they want social realism. Do they? Okay, yeah. What? I, I just, I'm, I think maybe that social realism is a bit... A bit what? A bit severe. Uh, and what, and you think people would prefer? Escapism. Are you making up words again? D uh, distractions. Like what? Something with a donkey. Something with a donkey. Chuckles. Chuckles. You laugh. Yes, I'm funny. Are you? My sonnets are laugh out loud funny. I just, I think people like limericks. Limericks. I mean, as long as they, they're, they're honest, as long as they, they put aside pseudo-intellectualism and... Have you personalised... A limerick. Might have done, yeah. For a charity event. People like limericks! There once was a man from Stratford. Well, that's not bad. That is bad. It's for charity. You know what? I think a charity would appreciate something a little more sincere. Like what? Like a sonnet. Yeah, I can think of a few charitable things to do with your sonnet. Yeah, well, seven shillings, baby! My limerick got fifty. Fifty? Fifty. Who paid? 50 shillings for a limerick. No matter. Who? I can't say. Tell me. The Queen. No! Yes, no! you know. She no! likes limericks. She does not like limericks! It's for charity! A pox on charity! It's a good cause! Oh, 50 shillings? Each. How many did you do? A few. No, 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 you're lying. I'm not lying. The Queen of England? Does not like limericks. The Queen of England bloody loves a limerick. Oh. And escapism. Oh, what? Did she did she want you to write a play with a donkey? Oh, why? Do you want to write it with me? No, I'd be scared my severity would dilute your vacuous crap. What the hell are you doing? Nothing. Nothing. What are you wearing? Costume. Why? For the sketch. What sketch? Your sketch. Oh, my sketch. The, uh, sorry, the comic relief sketch. This was just a suggestion. David's idea, really. Michael ordered the costumes. I this heard. isn't what we sent you. What, what do you mean? We sent a script to Simon. Oh. Uh, where, where is Simon? He's not here. Where is he? David said a couple of mean things to him. What did you say? He's called him a, a slap-faced one-trick fart balloon. No, but don't worry, because uh, we've done something ourselves. Yeah, Ooh, yeah, yeah, it might be better. Oh. 
Richard Curtis wrote the other one. Mm, Richard Curtis is yeah. good, David. Yeah. Richard Curtis is quite, quite good, yeah. It was funny. Might probably be funny. It's for a good cause. Yeah. Well, now, now, we did say that. We said that in the sketch, yeah. You yeah. weave that oh, one through. It's, yeah, it's, really, it's masterful. We needed you to thank people for their donations. Yeah, we just thought we'd spice it up a bit, you know. Yeah. Your actors, not writers, do the bloody job. Thank people for their donations, then get the hell out of the way. Yes, we'll do. Okay. Thanks, Len. Cheers. Go on, you start. All right. <clears throat> We've been blown away by the kindness of your donations. It's for such a good cause. A really serious cause. Especially now. So from us to you, thank you. Thank you. Do you think people will wonder about why we're wearing a costume? You mean like out of context? Yeah. No. No? We're actors. Ah, uh, morning, Lauren. Glad you could finally make the time for your one-to-one -one tutor session. All right. It was scheduled to start 20 minutes ago. Was it actually? Yes, actually, it was actually, yeah. Oh, sorry. I was doing my TikToks, innit? You were what? My TikTok, sir. I'm TikTok famous. Right. Well, I've been sat here waiting for you, so... I knew you were waiting for me. Good for you. Right, now, if I could turn your attention towards your self-assessment reflection, yeah? You're standing too close. Excuse me? You're standing too close to your computer, sir. You've got to stand two metres away, otherwise you could infect me with the virus. Don't be ridiculous. Social distancing, sir. You could be asymptomatic. I'm not asymptomatic. How do you know? Is your name Chris Whitty? Are you Chris Whitty, sir? Are you Chris no. Whitty, though? Can I ask you a question? No. Can I ask you a question, sir? I just want to ask you a question. Can I ask you a question? Go ahead. Are you, or have you ever been a doctor? No. Are you a member of the WHO? I'm not a doctor, but I do know you cannot catch a virus through a computer. Computer virus. Follow the science. That's not the same thing, and you know it. I ain't taking no chances. Take that off, Lauren. Droplets, innit? Lauren. This isn't for me. It's for you, sir. Take it off, please. I'm protecting you. I don't need protecting. Yeah, cos you're old, sir. I am 45 years old. Yeah, that's well old, sir. OK. You're vulnerable, sir. I'm not vulnerable. Do they let you shop early at Sainsbury's? No. Cos of your underlying condition. I don't have any underlying conditions. You're Scottish, sir. Being Scottish is not an underlying condition. The virus don't respect borders, sir. Your kilt cannot protect you. Right, I know what you're trying to do, Lauren. Are your grandchildren forced to sing happy birthday outside your window? I don't have grandchildren. Do you press your hand against a glass to say hello? That's not funny, Lauren. I know, sir, but it's the new normal. Enough! Your grades, Lauren, are headed on a downward trajectory. Just trying to flatten the curve, isn't it? Your tedious commitment to belligerence is stunning. Thank you. I know this is all a big game to you, Lauren. I get that. But I have to tell you right now, if you do not turn this attitude around, start to focus properly on your education from now on, you will get no exams. You will have very few options and an even bleaker future. Oh, here it comes. Fair enough. What? You make a valid point. Excuse me? Yeah, I hear what you're saying. And you agree with me? Yeah, I know I've got to turn things around, sir. I've had a lot of time to think during lockdown. A global pandemic can really focus your mind. I've got to stop messing about, ain't it? I don't want to look back and think I didn't fulfil my potential. I want to make something of my life. Cos if not now, sir, then when? What? Wow, I'm shocked. But I'm so glad to hear you talking like this, Lauren. I never thought anyone was going to be able to get through to you, but you're exactly right. Because you have potential, Lauren, you really do. You are so bright and imaginative. And if you could set your mind to it, you could achieve great things. I really believe in you, Lauren. I'm above it. <sighs> I'm above it, though. I ain't even bothered. You should you be. You think I'm bothered about exams? I don't care about exams, sir. Look at my face mask. Please. Is my face mask bothered? Lauren. My face mask ain't even bothered, sir. Just... Who's got all the hand sanitizer? I, I can't tell. Care. Have you been buying all the toilet roll? Toilet I don't roll. care because I ain't even bothered. I'm bothered about TikTok, Wh sir. What's don't that? Don't care about exams. Tic Tac. You can't get famous with a Tic Tac, sir. That's a breath mint. We could go viral like the virus. That's not appropriate. Do a TikTok with me, sir. No. I could make you TikTok famous. Lauren, though. I am not doing a TikTok with you. Seconds to Lonair, Mr. Henry. I'll be out in a sec, thank you. Comic relief, Salford, make some noise! Oh. 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 I've got to stop having them all you can eat hotel breakfasts. 
Lenny, you ready to go? <sighs> I feel funny. Well, that's good, isn't it? No, I feel sick. Uh, can you get me a glass of water, please? Can I get a water for Lenny Henry ASAP? No, not ASAP, it's CBE. Forget the water. What I need is a doctor. Comic Relief? <laughs>